Microsoft 365 Copilot is transforming the way teams collaborate and innovate with intelligent features designed to streamline tasks and, just as importantly, secure both your users and organization. Hi, I'm Kelly Malone for Connection. Today I'm joined by David Carey. And in this video, we're going to discuss security in Microsoft 365 Copilot. David, one essential principle underpinning Microsoft's approach to security is the zero trust model. Could you elaborate on what that entails and how it reinforces Microsoft's commitment to comprehensive protection? Microsoft's zero trust model is built on three key principles. Verify explicitly, which is where we want to make sure we authenticate and verify each request. Use least privilege access to give users only the access they need for only the amount of time that they need the access. And assume breach, where we always operate as if there's an active breach within our organization's infrastructure, and we deploy the necessary technologies to limit the impact of said breach. For example, access segmentation would be a good way to ensure that attacks can't traverse our infrastructure to other systems. I know that Microsoft has a few other apps and suites, uh, Defender being one of the first that come to mind. Could you share a little bit of information on how these fit into the bigger picture of protecting an organization? Absolutely. Defender consists of several solutions that allow an organization to truly put protection across all of the major components of their infrastructure. We have Defender for Endpoint, for example, where is it provides the protection, detection, and response for the threats local to the endpoint. Vulnerability management, which allows us to discover vulnerabilities across our devices. Defender for Office 365, which gives us the protection at the email, Teams, OneDrive, SharePoint level. And then Defender for Cloud Apps, which allows us to monitor and protect the use of third-party software as a service applications, as well as Microsoft 365 applications. And lastly, we have Defender for Identity, which gives us the protection on the identity level that, that detects and responds to threats based on signals from an Active Directory or cloud-based identity environment. How does Purview play into the security conversation? Purview offers a whole host of solutions to allow you to further protect and govern your data within Microsoft 365 and beyond. Some of the core solutions within Purview include things like information protection, where we're identifying, classifying, and protecting sensitive data with technologies like sensitivity labeling or sensitive information types. Also data loss prevention, which allows us to restrict further activities on data to prevent oversharing and data leakage. These solutions really are built to work together to allow organizations to take a zero trust approach with a unified platform. And if you really want to take security to the next level and really have a true full-blown unified solution, Microsoft 365 E5 really gives you the entire host of solutions available. Well, and that takes us into the discussion of licensing. Many organizations out there are familiar with the E3 level of Microsoft 365, but can you tell me a little bit more about what E5 offers in the way of security? Sure. So when you, when you step up to the Microsoft 365 E5 platform, we really have uh, the Defender suite that gives us Defender for Endpoint Plan 2, which gives us that true endpoint detection response functionality, automated investigations, and amongst other activities. Defender for Office 365, you also get the Plan 2 uh, subscription with the M365 E5, and that gives you some more advanced functionality to keep applying that protection at that email, SharePoint, Teams, OneDrive level as well. When we talk about Purview, this is really where the functionality starts to expand. We've got things like automatic sensitivity labeling, where we can apply labels at scale and automatically based on certain rules and requirements. Um, we do have also the extended capabilities of data loss prevention, where we can apply data loss prevention policies to Microsoft Teams data, for example, or even extend the use of it to local to the endpoint with endpoint data loss prevention. Um, and then we've got some other key uh, subscriptions in there as well, like insider risk management, privileged access management, and other solutions. Some other key additions also include insider risk management, privileged access management, and premium features within audit need discovery as well. Well, Microsoft 365 has security covered. David Carey, thank you so much. And thank you for watching. Threat detection and defense have evolved. Is it time to reinspect your security posture? Get started by contacting your Connection account team or visit connection.com slash copilot.